Hello, YouTubers! Marshall 149 is back, and I have more of Final Fantasy 1 Dawn of Souls. Uh, today, I am not getting lost. Today, we are going to begin our preparations for going into the Water Dungeon. Now, as you can see over here, there's a town. This is where the water dungeon is. I believe it's the town of Onrath or something like that. But if we go there, we can't enter the water dungeon yet. Instead, there is just a person who says that she needs us to go there, but we can't breathe underwater. So, let's go to a different town. Right across from the dragon caves, over here, north of the Citadel of Trials. And it's right up... Uh, no, I missed it. Eh. Okay, it's over here. There we go. The Eye of the Hawk. Gaia. Or Gaia, I don't know. This is Gaia. Yes, it looks like the Eye of the Hawk. Wing of the Hawk. Yes. We know about the Wing of the Hawk. I told- I mentioned that. Uh, anything they say there? Yeah, it, it, stop talking! Yeah, if you go there, there's a town uh, to the south. You notice this, this, uh, you might notice this, 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 that this continent, uh, looks like, kind of like a bird, and, uh, on one of the wings, quote-unquote, of the bird. Uh, well, among the wings of the birds, there's a town, and it's filled with people who don't speak your language. The Cat Claws are finally a better weapon for the Black Mage, but they're so ridiculously expensive, I'm not even sure if they're worth it. I'm gonna go here last. Uh, Ruby Armlet uh, is just a better piece of armor. That's definitely worth it. The Protect Ring very useful. It guards against instant death, so you'll definitely want to get some of those. I'll probably get all this stuff off screen. Uh, anyway, north to the magic shop. There's stuff we want to do. We got holy, null, and dispel. None of these spells are particularly useful. I know that sounds weird because holy seems like it's one of those things that would always be useful. By the way, these are level 8 spells. Actually, I can't even learn those yet. I'm too under-leveled, so I'll get those later. Sorry about the slight diversion there. Ah. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. This is pathetic. Okay, Se level 7 spells. <laughs> Blazaga and Break. We want to get... Break. We want to get both of them, because there are only two and they're both useful. Sort of. You'll see why I got Break later. Over here we have Kiraja and Diaja. Um, we're not going to be encountering all that many undead, so Diaja isn't very useful. Kiraja, on the other hand, we probably will use at some point as it restores an ally to full health. Yeah. All that money I got, using it up very quickly, thanks to these ridiculously overpriced spells. Special water called Oxiel gushes from the bottom of our spring, but only fairies can draw it out. Doesn't that make your spring a fairy fountain? It, yeah, I, I'm pretty sure it does. Item shop, I'll just, you're ignored. There's a guy blocking my path. There's a scholar studying the Lufenian language, but I can't seem to recall his name. Oh yeah, that's the uh, guy we met a while ago back in uh, Melbourne who said, INCONCEIVABLE! And uh, I made fun of him for that, of course. Uh, move out of the way! Thank you. Okay, we just need to talk to this guy now. I caught the fairy, so I figure she's... Hey, you stole our fairy! That never happened in Zelda. So I sold her to the caravan. Okay, then we need to find the caravan. 
Now, just like before, there are some people in Onrak who could tell us. I'm pretty sure that's what they call Onrak. I don't want to go to the town and check. But uh, there are some people in Onrak who would probably tell us where the caravan is, but it's not too hard to find. It's in the desert. It's right. Yeah, it's right there. So, of course, now I need to find a good place to park my airship. That works. Okay, and go here. There we are, the caravan. Now this is annoying. We have to buy the bottled ferry for 40,000. Actually, it's just 40. Yep, we have to buy it for 40,000. Yeah, I don't know what I was doing there. So, yeah, if you don't have 40,000 gil, uh, go out and gil grind for a while. Uh, because now we need to go back to Gaia, or Gaia, however you want to pronounce it. Uh, I'm just going to say Gaia, because that's how I've always pronounced it, and also, yeah, Gaia just sounds weird, in my opinion. Uh, here we are. This video is probably going to run over time, but I don't care. And now our fairy comes out, all nice and sparkly looking. Wait, come back. I have to get you to restore our health. Not that way. Okay, I know which way I'm going now. We're going to the spring, I mean, the... We're going to the spring fairy fountain. Thing. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there are springs of fairy fountain. Wouldn't make any sense otherwise. Oh yeah, those shrines? I actually never used one, so... They were only good in the original version of the game, I guess. And, yep, here it is. Let's talk to the fairy. You're the ones who rescued me from my ball! I'm sorry that I ran away, but I was just so scared! I'll give you some oxygen and the lava of the spring to make up for it, okay? How very nice of you. And, of course, my fairy voice sucks. That's the voice I use for, like, every fairy in any game ever. I use it for this one, I use it for Navi in a great time, I use it for Tail, or Tattle, in, uh, yours Mask. Air will fly out of that water for as long as you have it! Thank you. Get out of there. Okay. Next time. We go to Onrak, and I finish my preparations, and then we probably go in. See ya.